is reacting today to the murder of a well-known businessman. 62-year-old Patrick Murphy, the owner of Murphy's Jewelers in Pottsville, was found dead Thursday at a New Orleans hotel. Eyewitness News was first to tell you about the homicide last night on Eyewitness News at 11. Now Eyewitness News lead IT reporter Andy Mahalshik is working the story and joins us in the control center. Andy. Well, Mark, New Orleans detectives have issued an arrest warrant for a suspect in the murder of Patrick Murphy. They're actively searching for her right now. Meanwhile, news of Murphy's death has stunned many in Pottsville and beyond. Murphy's Jewelers on Market Street in Pottsville was dark Friday. A sign on the front door indicates the business was closed for a family emergency. New Orleans police say Patrick Murphy was found stabbed to death inside the Empress Hotel Thursday afternoon. Detectives say a hotel employee found him just after noon, unresponsive on the floor. He was covered in blood. Detectives issued an arrest warrant for 25-year-old Megan Hall. Sources close to the case say Murphy checked into the hotel at around 2 a.m. with a woman. And when he failed to check out, the hotel employee entered the room and discovered his body. Very shocking, uh, very disturbing. Uh, I did catch your news on it and uh, I was very surprised about it. Murphy was owner of Murphy's Jewelers, a landmark family-owned business that's been in Pottsville for more than 100 years. Word of his violent death has people talking. Very unfortunate that that would happen to this gentleman because of all the kind things that he did for this community. Sometimes tourists, you know, get targeted like that, and maybe that's what happened with him. It's, it's unfortunate. Now, Murphy was well known for support of the Pottsville business community, especially the downtown shopping district. But he was also a big supporter of many charitable organizations and nonprofits. Coming up on Eyewitness News at 6, we will hear from some of the folks who knew him best. Reporting in the Control Center, Andy Mahal, Chicago Eyewitness News. Mark? Sad and stunning news, Andy. Thank you. Now, Megan Hall is wanted on charges of second degree murder. New Orleans police are not saying anything about a possible motive for the killing.